Do you have money that you're looking to invest but are not quite sure of where? Here's a reason why you should consider investing it in the stock market. Uh, if I invested, uh, if I bought a stock, a particular share at 100 shillings, and tomorrow it appreciates to 120, I would be making a capital gain of 20 shillings. That is on top of the fact that uh, these shares in which we are investing in uh, companies that pay dividends when, when uh, based on, on, on their performance. Also, if you're looking for flexibility, investing in the stock market offers you an opportunity to easily convert that investment into cash or liquidity. There, there, there are investments like land. It, it won't be so easy for you to turn land into cash because you need to look for a buyer. It's, as, it's, 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 it's far easier to look for a buyer to buy your stocks and turn that into cash than it is for land today. So that is the other very, very important fact why uh, companies, why institutions would uh, choose to invest in the stock market uh, other than investing in probably other assets like land and all that. Um, and this liquidity, it goes further than that. Uh, one of the other reasons is that I may, have, I may be looking for an asset to invest in that will have a structured cash flow. This, however, is not to suggest that this line of investment does not present any risks. Uh, the, the prices can go up and down. Because they are volatile, if at one point in time they're not doing well, you can give it some time and they recover, and then you can invest in there, and then you can be able to uh, probably sell out and make a capital gain. This is why good financial counsel is critical for anyone planning to invest in equities. You need to do some research on your own or you need to have uh, someone at the back uh, trying to, ad uh, to advise you uh, on the performance of these particular companies that, that you invested in. The first basic thing is to go to a brokerage firm, uh, then you can talk to the, uh, to, 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 the, uh, to the people that are actually allowed, licensed by the, stock, by the Capital Markets Authority to interface with clients and they would, ex they would explain to you all these factors. The recommended lowest amount of money you can invest in the stock exchange is 50,000 Uganda shillings. Experts, however, advise a higher investment because, like the saying goes, the higher the risk, the greater the return.